So this is yours truly, J. Blue, again on October the 27th, Saturday on the comic book Hollow Fest. And I'm about to do a comic book haul real quick. Show the comics I picked up this morning while out at Comic City. Um, first we have here Thor, War of the Realms, as you can see. I like that cover. As you can see there, Halloween Comic Fest. Now, not all of these books are from the Halloween Comic Fest. Some of the books I actually, some books I purchased, um, and then others were for free. This is for free. Uh, yeah, here, the Spider-Man Ultimate Web Warriors. Again, nice artwork. This is actually a TV series as well. So, Spider-Man Ultimate Spider-Man Web Warriors. That's the Halloween, the Comic Fest Halloween logo on it. Next up, we have Batman Adventures. Oh, what is that? Oh, it looks like a Walking Dead bookmarker. Look at that. Pretty cool. I forgot I picked that up, too. <laughs> okay. But Batman Adventures uh, from um, the animated series that was out a couple years back. Dig that artwork. And once again, you have the Halloween Comic Fest logo. Uh, Comic City. That's my receipt there. <laughs> okay. Uh, looks like we got another War of Realms, so I got a duplicate copy there. I'll give that away to somebody. Um, Superior Spider-Man number one by Dan Slott. Good writer, Ryan Stegman, Edgar Delgado. The writers and artists of this series see the Superior Spider-Man's latest plans unfold. And this is actually a tie-in to the Spider-Geddon series, which recently started. And if you don't know... Uh, Ultimate Spider-Man is actually Doc Ock, also known as Dr. Octopus. So that's pretty neat right there. Here is, uh, looks like Adventures of Serena, uh, Sabrina, I'm sorry. This is actually a comic book take on the new Netflix series that just started yesterday. Not really interested in watching the series, but I might peep it out, but yes. Yeah, also from the Archie series, you can see right there, Archie. But yes, this is actually a series on Netflix now, Sabrina. So, I just picked, decided to pick it up anyway, what the heck. The maniac, crazy sexy girl there, Harley Quinn. DC Comics. Standing there with... A gigantic hammer about to slug somebody in the head or whatever. Looks like she has actually taken a swing at some people. See a leg and some roller skates right there. Yeah, she's actually, um, looks like she's, uh, taking a beating to some people already. So that's that. Uh, dig that. This is from the True Believers series that actually started a month ago. That's um, Wolverine and Sabretooth. I really like that. That's a nice cover. Looks like they're fighting in the snow with each other. These two have been going with, going at it with each other for years. Man. Never ending battle between Wolverine and Sabretooth, who are actually brothers in the comic books. Victor Creed and James Howlett, also known as Logan. Another Wolverine comic, Sword Quest. Robert Kirkman. Ah, Robert Kirkman has wrote this book. You know Robert Kirkman is. He's actually the writer, uh, if I'm correct, of The Walking Dead. If I'm correct. Or am I incorrect? I'm not sure. I'm familiar. I know that name, Kirkman. It's definitely familiar. Uh, so, I'll just check back in some of my comic books here to see if I see his name. No, I don't see it here. But yeah, so that's uh, that's a nice cover there. The artwork is decent, you know. Uh, I think I like the artwork for the other Wolverine comic a lot better. 
And as most of you may or may not know, Wolverine has made a return. In the Marvel Universe, he was dead, but he's back now. So, that's that. And there is The Walking Dead. Yep, Robert Kirkman. There he is. I was looking for that book, and there it is. <laughs> so, Robert Kirkman, Walking Dead. Also, uh, this is actually in the dollar rack. Um, over in Comic City. They have three locations in Michigan. West Bloomfield, Canton, and I think the other one is in um, Pontiac or Trenton, Michigan. They used to have four, but one of them closed up recently. Okay, so that's that. That's Batman Rebirth as part of the DC Rebirth series. You got Batman, it looks like Lucius Fox, I think, and... Um, of course, uh, the detective there, uh, Commissioner Gordon, not Detective Gordon, Commissioner Gordon. I don't know who those two are right there. Those look like new characters in the uh, Batman series. Nice cover. Love that artwork. Kitty Pride, also known as Shadow Cat and Wolverine together. Uh, the True Be Marvel True Believers series. Very nice, very nice. Looks like they might be in Japan or China or something. I see some um, Chinese or Japanese hieroglyphs there. Or writing. And once again in the winter. What is it with, Lo with Logan or Wolverine in the winter time, man? I don't know. Yeah, but that was a dollar, so... Thanos, the man himself, and the Silver Surfer, Rebirth of Thanos, I said that kind of loud, didn't I, Thanos, I can use actually use my creepy voice too, Thanos, Rebirth of Thanos, yeah, I can do that, I'm actually going to one day do a, um, I'm going to, uh, <laughs> Do some voiceovers for you guys if you can hear me, hear my um, other talent. I'm really pretty good with voiceovers. So, Rebirth of Thanos. Wolverine again. Wolverine Evolution from the True Believers series. There's a parental advisory uh, suggested, printed on the cover. Because not all comic books are for kids to read, to, to read excuse me. Um, there are some comic books that are very, very uh, adult themed. Just an FYI there. I'm digging that uh, artwork. And remember I said Logan and um, Victor Creed, also known as Sabretooth, always fighting each other, man. Never ending battle between those two. Wolverine again. It looks like Magneto, Professor X, and Quicksilver. And probably um, Rogue on the cover in the background there. Look at that. Fatal Attractions. Yeah, that's Rogue. Professor X. Yeah, and Quicksilver. No parental guidance or anything on the cover. So I guess kitties can read this one. Let's move that out of the way. Cyborg, DC Comics, also seen in the recent Justice League movie. This is from the, Re uh, the DC Rebirth series again. Look at that artwork. Very nice, very nice. Liking that. Not a big Cyborg fan, but, you know, still good to see him. And that's it. So, that's my comic haul uh, for today. Again, October the 27th, Saturday. So, head on out to your local comic book shop. See if they're giving away free comics. Uh, there are a lot more that they're actually offering, but these are the ones that I picked up that I enjoy uh, amongst my own personal selection. So, everyone have a great day. I hope you've enjoyed this haul. Thank you again to all my subscribers. Please hit the like button if you liked it. Um, I think the lighting on this video is a lot better than the others. But hit the like button, subscribe, 
um, and also tap the bell so you can get any, any and all videos as they come in. Okay? Peace, love, and hair grease.